Hey guys and welcome to my official Road to Glory in FIFA 22 Zero to Hero. Today I'm going to show you guys how to get the best possible free massive packs in Ultimate Team, big trading methods I'm currently using and showing you how we've made this very nice amount of coins already. So a quick update on the Road to Glory squad. This is my current 50k team. I did make a separate video on this the other day and it's been absolutely wonderful. We are 14 wins and two losses so far in division rivals. We've managed to sell a few more items there and we've also sold this guy for 3k. We are currently in division seven and playing some nice FIFA. I'm still trying to learn the game a lot as you might be as well. Now, a lot of you guys have been asking like, Matt, what are you going with on the transfer market right now? And to show you what I've been going with, we have invested heavily in Aspilicueta. I think he's far too cheap at that price of 1.3K. And especially when a player of the month SPC is most likely, maybe more so when there's a hype, like a really hyped up like SPC or play of the month SPC. So another good player, guys, that I'm probably going to invest in right now, to be honest, is Gerard. PK. Now, I will be showing you guys how I got this amount of coins later on on the video on today's episode, but basically, um, we packed someone very good. That's what I'll say. And we've also made some nice coins via trading on stream. So, Gerard PK for me is far too cheap. I will probably get about maybe 10 of these cards and then sell when I think the time is right. You know, if there's a good SPC, guys, I won't be surprised if he goes like 7k um, eventually, but he's a player that I really want to see go up in price preferably with a big sbc right now there's probably more to do here so again another great recommendation from an amazing trader by the name of zinja shout out my man leveled up official and zinja they basically said like matt you've got to go invest in this guy gerard moreno 86 rating obviously very very desirable um position in terms of like his league his nation i believe he yeah look at that 86 rated player for that amount of coins guys that is insane one big tip in terms of trading which i'm doing right now always spread out your investments when you can don't just put everything into like one player for example 5.4k though for an 86 rated player he could he could easily i reckon he could probably triple in price when there's a really high pest bc i might keep hold of that card guys until he um, goes up a lot in price there. I think he might be 5.5 to snipe, but again, maybe buy like, you know, a few of these. It, it, there's no harm in doing this, guys. If, if you've got like 100K, then I really do recommend getting some of these kind of players and holding them until they go up in price quite significantly. It really, really could be worth your time. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if there's a few more there, you know. There you go, 5.2. Bang, look at that. There's no, guys, I easily see him doubling in price with the right SBC. I might hold on to those cards for a while, but overall, I'm happy with that investment there of Gerard Moreno, 5.5 there again. Yeah, I think he could double in price quite easily. Now, guys, another really good player that I would advise potentially investing in if you've got the right coins there is Trippier. Obviously, being English, links to the Premier League, La Liga, any SBC player or, you know, 84 rated player or 85, 86 that can really link well to multiple leagues, in my opinion, is a very good shout for potential good investment down the road, right? Trippier with the links to the Premier League and having the right back position and being 84 rated is pretty astonishing being this price. I mean, 1.7K, guys. We've all seen it before. When there is an incredibly hyped SBC like the first, let's say there's a guarantee... Oh, look at this. Let's say there's a guaranteed ones-to-watch SBC... There's no way that this Trippier card stays at this price. I mean, we've seen it before when an 8480 card has been extinct at 10k, has been like 7,000 coins. There's no way this card's going to stay that price. Absolutely no chance. So it truly is about just being smart with these investments, guys, spreading out the coins here. And then when the time is right, by being patient, looking at the SBCs, if it's a really crazy new SBC that people are wanting to complete, not a Shakiri SBC, not that one. Let's say it's a guaranteed ones to watch pack and it's 85 rating. This card could quadruple in price, triple in price. I really believe that. And that's why I'm going for it. This is too cheap of a card to ignore. If you're on the transfer market, why are people not like investing in this card enough? That's mad. Jorginho, guys, 85 rating. Links to the Premier League, Serie A, players like Marco Verratti, Immobile. That is a, fen that is a phenomenal price. 
So we've just invested, guys, quite a lot of coins there into those cards that I believe will definitely rise, in my opinion, in terms of new SBCs coming out and brand new ones to watch promo, which is probably going to be the most hyped ones to watch promo of all time. We're probably going to get guaranteed ones to watch packs. Now is the time to look at these players and think what are the cheapest options per rating, right? Gerard Moreno, 86 rating, guys. We've seen those cards go for like 17k in the past. I mean, that could be incredible. Jorginho as well. And this is all a part of the grind on the road to glory, man. I really want to invest in these cards, make some lovely coins there. And uh, yeah, we could probably add another 100k's worth of players onto my investments there. So yeah, they're my investments, guys, on the road to glory today. We're now going to get into the pack rewards of what we got from grinding FIFA 22. Right, so the first amazing 100k pack that you're gonna wanna unlock is this one here, guys. Now that is the 500 goals with squad rating of 85 plus. Now, the fastest ways, in my opinion, of getting this unlocked, and I'm gonna start this on my road to glory shortly, is either squad battles beginner mode, where you can maybe score 40 to 45 goals per game, like we did on stream earlier today. You can also get this done in friendly so if you have a friend who's got fifa 22 as well and they're willing to give you so many goals per game then that could be a way of doing it as well i believe you probably need about 13 maybe 14 games to complete this maybe a bit more but in terms of fast efficiency of getting this done the best way is either playing a friend online or in squad battles and that would probably save you potentially this could save you like hundreds of games if you didn't do that. If you were playing online FIFA on Rivals, Foot Draft, or even Squad Battle, no, maybe not Squad Battles, any online mode basically against a random opponent, you get this done so much slower, honestly. Try and find a friend who's got FIFA 22, guys. Get them onto FIFA. Maybe you can do it for each other when you give each other goals. And that way you get a 100k pack. This pack could be magnificent. Could have an icon. Could have Bruno Fernandes. Could have Ronaldo. You never know. The next pack that has been amazing for me on the road to glory is the score 100 finesse goals objective. This is a very brilliant pack to unlock early on in Ultimate Team. And I believe we got someone incredible from this pack today. It is crazy what we got from this one, guys. I scored 100 finesse goals, guys, in about three squad battles games, I think. I think it was three. And yeah, it was really, really straightforward to get. This is a 50k pack. This could be amazing for your road to glory again. You might want to do this on squad battles. It'll take you three games to do, about an hour overall, rather than just grind this in rivals. It's a really good pack to get done early on in Ultimate Team. And again, another 100k pack here, guys, for your Ultimate Team squad and maybe your Road to Glory is again by going on squad battles or playing a friend online to get this free 100k pack. This could change your whole FIFA 22 club. Another big pack there, guys, is the win 100 co-op matches. Now, that will take a lot longer in terms of, um, you know, you can't really back out unless... Can you play 2v2 online with friends? If you can play 2v2 friends online then that might be brilliant yeah that would be pretty cool actually i'm gonna get that done soon though because i love playing co-op on fifa it's so much fun so that's another big pack there guys that you might want to unlock another massive pack to get there guys is another huge 50k pack for your ultimate team there you've got to use these bronze players guys in this objective here to get the 50k pack and again this is a very very easy way of getting a nice pack to begin your ultimate team journey win 15 games there with an all bronze squad in any game mode so for me you want to play a friend again guys to get that one done fast really simple that one and again i would probably try and play against any of your friends on fifa with a bronze team and do the exact same thing with the silver team notice there it does say any game mode i mean that's that's two packs there worth 100k. That is so worthwhile doing. You're probably going to pack some big walkouts from this, guys. It's that good. Now, this is a pack that I thought I was so close to getting when I saw this objective there, which is to say win three matches in any game mode with a starting squad of first-owned players. And then I saw this one, guys, win 100 matches in rivals with at least seven first-owned players. So although the rivals grind is naturally going to be kind of insane this FIFA, this one, you just have to grind this one. There's no like quicker way of playing friends or squad battles. This is one that will take time. But again, hopefully you can pack a cheeky, I don't know, 
Zola from this 100k pack. Now, another way to get a really great set of amazing packs in FIFA 22 is for Champions Playoffs. And then once you've qualified, you can then have the chance to win some massive packs. Now, for Champions Finals, correct me if I'm wrong, does not look as mad intense as other FIFAs, going off the fact that in order to get those elite rewards, I believe you need 44 points, right? So if I've worked this out correctly, I think you need eight or 12 wins out of 20 to get the premium team of the week pack and also one of four for champions players. I think I've worked that out correctly. On stream, people were saying that it was eight wins to get elite rewards. I believe that is elite. Is that elite? No, the next one. So yeah, I think it's eight wins and then the rest can be draws or losses to get that. So I'm very intrigued to see how easy, easily attainable these rewards are. But again, you've got seven entries to get into Foot Champions Finals, which is, in my opinion, pretty a very good amount. In previous FIFA's, I think it was like one of four chances with the daily knockout tournament. So seven entries there to get five wins out of eight. Is it's looking good. And again, if you guys can get these set of rewards here when you get to the point system of Foot Champions Finals. And let's say even you get to, you know, here, that, that that's a very good set of packs there. And also the chance of one or three players. So this is another way to get a lot more out of FIFA and a really good way of getting way more coins in the game. Yeah, I've just realized, guys, that's, I think I'm nearly right with that. So one win is four points. So let's say you get, um, yeah, let's say you get eight wins there that will get you to uh, 32 points, right? Eight times four is 32. Then eight, then 12 losses would get you elite. So you only need, wow, that's nuts. That's, uh, that's wow, holy crap, that's amazing for the road to glory. The thing is, the games are gonna be really difficult, I, I imagine. So eight games out of 20, if you win, then I think you get, you do. Yeah, that's. I think that's right, isn't it? It is. 32 plus 12 and 20 take row 12 equals 8. Yeah, that's right. So if you win 8 out of 20, guys, you've got a premium team of the week pack, one of four two-player pick packs there, and 100k pack, and 35k. That is really incredible. What's the next set again? That is 60k for that. Wow. So... I'm kind of mind blown. I finally figured out how the Foot Champions finals packs are going to work. But again, another really efficient way, guys, of getting more and more coins on this game and more free packs. And there's been a lot of people complaining about the Division Rivals reward system. I want you guys to comment right now in the comment section. Is this a good system or bad system? The reason why I thought originally this was a fantastic system is because I thought you got reward every time you got three or seven wins per division. Turns out you only get, I believe, the rewards from the division you're in before Rivals Rewards release on, I think, a Thursday. So you don't get, for example, Division 10, 9, 8 on Thursday, even though I've got those objectives unlocked. I'm not sure how I feel about it. I, I don't know. Would that be too many packs? Maybe? I don't know, guys. What do you think? Anyway, first massive tip of the day is to go into the SBCs. And whatever you do, guys, when you begin FIFA 22, you've absolutely got to go and complete these incredible, and I really mean fantastic, SBCs. These are the hybrid leagues, hybrid nations, and league and nation hybrid SBCs. I've completed all these, and you're going to see the pack rewards. We have packed some fantastic players from this today. It's stunning. Now, a crazy tip that I want to thank you guys on the stream for telling me all about is the new loyalty glitch. And in a very quick way, I'll explain how to do this very, very simply. All you guys want to do is go to friendlies, then go to play online, play the new beginnings game mode, literally go into a game with the specific players you want to get the loyalty in, maybe give the opponent a goal, or you can just back out and you're done. It's that simple. It's the quickest loyalty glitch we've ever done. That's how I got the loyalty guys to complete these SBCs so fast today. I'm liking it though. I'm loving the passing. I'm enjoying, I'm loving like actually streaming gameplay. That, that's a big, big change from previous FIFAs. Right. We've not opened the pack yet, guys. Right. 50k pack. This is for the prediction. Then we're going to 
attempt to do the loyalty. Oh, walk out. Let's go. <laughs> wow. How much is he worth on the road to glory? Oh my God. Wow. 100 finesse goals. Nah, that's ridiculous, guys. Is he 200k? Please be 200k. Be 200k. Oh, let's go. Apparently, he's 200,000 coins. Bloody hell, guys. That's our best pack on the road to glory so far. We needed something, and we've got it. That's fantastic. On a ro Oh, my God. On a road to glory as well? Nah, that's ridiculous, guy. He's untradeable. Oh my god, is he untradeable? Oh my god, what a pack. Don't tell me that's untradeable. Don't tell me that's untradeable. Please. It's untradeable. <laughs> oh my god, I thought that was tradable. What a pack though, but come on, man. He's actually untradeable. Oh, Jesus. We can obviously use his card, but the issue is, guys, he, I mean, <sighs> I could have made 200,000 coins there. That, that one hurts, guys. Uh, 8.9k. That's really an That really is an amazing pack, though. Loads of AC4s, Goretzka, Muller. I mean, it, it still is a very good pack, but I thought it was tradable. I think we do... I'll do the rare mix player pack, see if we can get another cheeky walkout. That'd be a bit, a bit of a bad start. Oh my god. Bruno! Oh, that's tradable! <laughs> what is our pack look today? Oh my god, that, that is actually tradable. Nah, that is actually tradable, guys. Oh my god. What the hell? Please, 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 please be worth something mad. That is unbelievable, guys. What is happening? What is happening, guys? Oh, my God. Our pack look today is insane. Right, how much is Bruno Fernandes? On a road to glory, that's massive. That isn't... Please be tradable. It is tradable. We have just got so lucky on the road to glory. That's a rare mixed player pack from completing... I think it was that hybrid league SBCs. That, my friend, is absolutely insane. Bruno Fernandez. How much, guys, is he worth? Please be expensive. He is 180. W that is cracked. I just realized we can now build a... Chat, we can now build like a 200k team. I think he's 160k. That's ridiculous. What a start. Goretzka, Thomas Muller in the last one. Now we're getting... Uh, yeah, now we're getting Bruno Fernandez, bro. That is actually ridiculous, chat. Jesus Christ. How much would you sell him for, Drakken? 170? Yeah, that, that's that's mad. Higuain there. The thing is, we can maybe use some of these cards in the uh, like for loyalty. It is done. Loyalty, guys, unlocked. Absolutely ridiculous. PS4 is so slow. Well, apparently, PS4 is like nowhere near the capability of next-gen consoles with FIFA 22. They've specifically made this new FIFA for next gen. I, I think. I think I'm right in saying that. Right, guys. Well, we've got it completed. <laughs> League and Nation Hybrid is ready to go. Anyway, welcome to Zero to Hero, guys. My road to glory on FIFA 22, the ultimate RTG. We're hopefully going to get someone... Um, oh, let's go. Hopefully going to get someone ridiculous today. Um, we still have not sold Coutinho. This is the risk you do take. Like, again... Longley, I, I think Longley might have been price. I mean, how much is it? It's still 1.2. Chad, these cards are still too cheap. I still think RK might have been price, like 5k potentially on launch day. We, I can't forget, guys, the game is not even properly out yet. That's the mad thing. This game is not fully out. Most people have not got FIFA 22, guys. The most we'll see it will be on launch day and that week. It's going to be nuts. Right. Um, I'm going to open... The small goal player pack. See if we can get a cheeky uh, board player. Oh, God. Right. Chat. CD. Oh, wow. Nah, that's broken. We might sell. Yeah, we might sell Bruno, guys. 84 Brozovic, guys, on the stream. Not too um, not too bad of a pack. I mean, is that tradable? 
Again, these 84s are so cheap. It's so worth holding on to these cards, man. It really, really is. No walkout Mega Pack, but we do get another 84. We are getting a lot of good SBC fodder. If there is like a big, um, I guess a big SBC that drops this week, we might be getting a big ones to watch SBC, for example. This is really nice. Yeah, he might go for like, he's 2.7. These cards, chat, I really need to invest in these 84s, like, fast. That's just ridiculous. We've got to get that card. There you go. 1.2k. Again, we'll keep hold of that card, guys. 1.2. That is a lovely, lovely snipe. Right, 1.2k. You guys agree that this card will not stay at this price. That is honestly, in my opinion, a great shout. That That is never going to be 1.2 when there's a big SBC as well. There's no way he says that price. Right, I'll go for that, and then we'll go from there. We can uh, keep those cards on the list. Cool. It's all the grind, man. Let's go about the grind and the road to glory. Let's go. Hey, Matt, did you meet a player in a taxi? We once met Emilio Butragueno, guys. In, um, he, he nearly got into my taxi, basically. <laughs> right. Rare Mega Pack. If we get a walkout, that'd be brilliant. Two minutes, guys, left with the sub giveaway. Walkout. Tiago, 86, guys. Another walkout again. Our pack look, guys, is genuinely been pretty brilliant so far today. We absolutely take that. Right, that is kind of cracked. Chat, a, a cheeky walkout from the rare mega pack, we take that. That's stunning. Right, let's go. Oh my god, what a pack. Oh, is he 9k? Wow. Wow, right. We got very lucky there, guys. Lucas, thank you to tier one, mate. Get enter, bro, quickly, man, to the FIFA 22 giveaway. Um, that's crazy. 6K. Is he 6K still? I'll list him for like that. He might go for that. Does Depay sell? Holy crap, right. 20K. Guys, we, we're on our way to 50 million coins. Chat, we're on our way to 50 million coins. It's actually happening. 174K. I think I might sell his card, guys. That's a really... Re his price range is 250 as well. And people aren't really liking this card. I think that's a good shout. 170. Bang, he's on the market, guys. Let's go. Big coin tier today on the uh, Road to Glory. Jordi Alba might go as well. I'll keep... I'll keep uh, he might go up in price. He might go extinct, actually. Let's get on the grind chat. We need to get some more rewards. We're trying to get all these milestones unlocked as well. Um... And again, like we gotta get that, we gotta get qualified, man. We really do. First game of the day. We're trying to get rivals rewards unlocked. Get better at this game. Good goal, man. Not a good start. Right, got lucky, guys. Right, right back to me there. We get the goal. Chat. We can't get more lucky than this. Oh my god, we are getting so lucky. Bang, what a goal. Right, that's our only good goal so far, guys. Let's go. Big, big finish that. What a ball. Oh, what a ball. He scores this. Oh! Oh my god, Jesus is broken. What a goal overall. Holy crap, that was nice. Look at the angle his body, like, contorts to. I, I don't know. I think we've gone up in division, guys. Hold on. Have we gone? Oh, let's go. Right, I think we're division seven, guys. Hey, Matt, do you reckon that 1.2 Aspel Equesta will hit 3k on Friday? I think he might do. Maybe when there's a big SPC. Yeah, guys, Bruno sold for 170k today. That's That's insane. We packed in today, man. That's crazy. Our best pack pull so far. So hopefully this helps you make more coins in FIFA 22. Picking the right players at the right time, which I believe is now, which could rise with the first promo of FIFA 22, coinciding with the launch week. You can make a lot of coins, guys. Potentially millions and hundreds of thousands of coins. Good luck with your road to glory, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed this video of the new Zero to Hero. I'm streaming, guys, most mornings on Twitch right now as well. Have a special day. And how many coins have you got in Ultimate Team?